Hi, I'm Noah Bombard, and here's what's happening in the ET Newsroom Friday, August 27th. Well, she's one of the city of Lawrence's more vivacious city councilors. Uh, she, her name is Sandy Almonte. She's the uh, city councilor for District A. And there's actually a video uh, circulating around uh, on YouTube right now of her in a dunk tank uh, outside uh, the Roxy in Essex Street uh, recently. Uh, it's creating a little bit of buzz among some of our readers. Uh, there are some comments online. Our own Jill Harmasinski is actually working on a follow-up story to this. Her video appears to be shot uh, late at night or early in the morning hours. Uh, like I said, outside the Roxy in, on Essex Street in Lawrence, uh, the councillor uh, taunts uh, some of the, uh, the, the onlookers there, uh, splashing them. And, uh, and of course, in the end, uh, unfortunately, she does uh, get the tank. You can find those uh, full YouTube clips on the Behind the Headlines uh, blog. I've posted those there. And as I said, uh, Jill will have a story in uh, tomorrow's paper. Well, it seems some people are really making themselves home at the Bellevue Cemetery in Lawrence. Uh, cemetery officials are complaining that uh, some uh, family members have gone a little bit too far in uh, decorating uh, the graves of some of their loved ones. Well, of course, putting flowers around a gravestone is nothing new. Some people put planters. In this case, however, uh, cemetery officials are saying that uh, some families are actually erecting more permanent structures, putting up fences, walkways, uh, other types of things that are interfering uh, with the cemetery's ability to keep the place clean. Now there's really two issues with the story. One of it just has to do with staffing at the cemetery. The cemetery that at one point had uh, five people taking care of it is now down to two people. They say that makes it a little more challenging for them to keep the cemetery clean, especially when they have to maneuver around uh, some of these uh, constructed uh, memorials that have been put up around the, the gravestones themselves. But aside from the staffing issue, a part of the problem is simply these memorials. Uh, according to officials, uh, one woman showed up recently uh, with boards in a concrete mix and actually began pouring uh, her own memorial. People are adding curbing and fencing and all kinds of other uh, items. Uh, we have a number of people already commenting on this story this morning online. Uh, some people saying, hey, look, you know, if you've bought the plot, don't you own that? Don't you have the right to do whatever you want to uh, to that plot? We'd like to hear your opinion, so make sure and uh, voice your comments on that story as well. Well, we're continuing to follow a number of news stories as we go into the weekend. We've got a big Sunday paper plan. Make sure and check that out. As always, you can find all this content and a lot more at eaglespune.com right now.